Well, folks, uh, to get me to record a video at 8.30 a.m., you know um, some stuff's got to be crazy. I, I'm sure you guys have seen the markets. It's a... Uh, it's it's a bad day. It's a bad day, right? Uh, Nasdaq's down three percent. Russell's down one point six percent. Now that is a move for the Russell. That's not anything crazy. Um, you would expect a lot of your stocks to be down one percent, two percent, three percent, maybe some four or five percent movers. That if they're really like doing an outsized move here today on a day like that, when the Russell's down like that, and I'm talking about small caps, right? You would expect something like that. And um, obviously over this weekend, we know Big K Dog. he put out his massive video to his massive audience um, that he sold out of all his stocks, right? So let's go ahead and let's take a look at how YouTube stocks are doing today. There's certain stocks we all know of on this uh, platform that are very, very popular. They get a lot of videos made about them. They're always a subject of debate. People have big ownership positions in them. So I'm interested to see what happens a day after, obviously, Kevin goes from buying the dip, ultra bullish to all of a sudden, I sell out of everything. Oh, he's shorting the market now. Like, what happens after that day, okay? Woo-wee! We'll see what happens after that day. Palantir stock down 10%. We know Palantir is a very popular stock here on YouTube. And people sold out of that like it was uh, going to zero today or something like that. Sell, sell, like every share in sight being sold in Palantir today. That's not even a small cap and they're just still, but this is a YouTube stock. And when you have the biggest YouTuber in the stock market space, Kevin, all of a sudden saying, I'm selling everything, I'm shorting the market. People are gonna, f you know, freak out, and that is clearly what is going on with the YouTube stocks here today. Look at Neo stock. Neo stock very popular on YouTube, down twelve percent here today. Twelve percent, just a massive move down. Uh, obviously, no one held more shares than Kevin in good old Tesla Maesla, right? Tesla's more than just a YouTube stock. We all know that. But at the end of the day, who owns more Tesla shares than anybody else on YouTube? And by a lot, right? I know what everybody else owns, and I know what he owned, and no one owned more than him, okay? Look at the chef here today. 11%. It doesn't matter about the chef's future. None of that matters. It's sell by any means necessary here today. Look, that's just unbelievable, really. Look at Corsair Gaming. Corsair Gaming, another popular YouTube stock. Corsair Gaming had been holding up very steadily, right? Corsair Gaming was down um, like 2% year to date. Corsair Gaming here today down over 11% percent uh, just a massive move down fubu tv fubu whatever you want to call it down 10 and a half percent here today skills this is another one of those type of stocks right down 10 plus percent here today lemonade stock down 10 percent here today the moves are just massive it is a straight up panic sell and there's there's um you know just people are freaking out right now just an absolute freak out like i've honestly i don't think i've ever really seen this bad of a freak out when it comes to these stocks have already been heavily devastated right this isn't like we're in some situation where you know stocks have been flying high and it's like oh yeah we were due for a big sell-off you know these stocks were up big time or something like that we were due for a big downward day no all the stocks i just showed you pretty much all those stocks outside of maybe tesla is down 50 plus percent from highs. A lot of those stocks are down 60, 70 percent from highs, okay? It's not like these stocks are just down, um, you know, uh, like like a little bit or like they've been flying high. That's not the situation. They're just getting absolutely devastated and people are, are just selling. And in a situation like this, I'm just nothing but disappointed, unfortunately, right? Um, that just, uh, Folks are choosing not to buy the dip in great companies, some of them great companies that have unbelievable futures, and they're just saying, you know, I don't care, I'm just, I want out of this market. And um, when you get that sort of flip, um, you know, it's just vicious. And that's where you get a day like today where countless of these stocks is down 10% or so. And, um, you know, yeah, uh, you know, I'll cover this more in depth. I just like, you know, pretty shocking, uh, nonetheless. But should I expect it? I, I guess not. You know, a lot of people, you know, trade off a certain person's opinion, and if that person goes from ultra bullish to selling out of everything and shorting, they're 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 not going to even think about it. They're just going to sell everything in sight, and so that's how you get the Russell going down 1.6 percent. YouTube stocks down 10 percent today, um, like a, like a move that's just so unnatural. It's like the, the you know. 
So anyways, guys, whew, crazy. Uh, I obviously got to cover a lot more later today when, you know, I, I get a little more awake here, but that's nuts.